10 priced out of her motel during the Super Bowl, but now one Valley woman has a new place to live, and that's all thanks to the generosity of our community. Yeah, this is a story we've been following for days now, and tonight, our Venton Blandin witnessing this act of kindness firsthand. Oh my goodness. On a dreary Tuesday afternoon, Sue found her own rainbow. Almost immediately, she's brought to tears inside her new apartment in Chandler. She walks from the front to the back. It's great. I'm very, very, very happy. I'm so appreciative. I have a home. <laughs> ABC 15 first met Sue more than a week ago after she emailed to say the upcoming Super Bowl was raising hotel prices. I wanted to speak for me and my neighbors and everybody that was going to be that was struggling when we found out the prices were going to be up and a lot of us looked at each other not knowing what we were going to do. She was four days from being forced onto the streets until an ABC 15 viewer paid the increased rates to keep her in a local Motel 6 for another week. I haven't had a key in a long time. This is unbelievable. Sue has stayed, she says, in hotels and motels for about two years. She guesses she spent more than $50,000 in that time. Now she has a home thanks to another viewer working with Sundial Real Estate to pay Sue's security deposit and first month's rent for a one-bedroom apartment. I'm probably going to sit on the floor and look around and just soak it all in. Sue continued exploring her new apartment. So obviously ABC 15 was Sue's first visitor, but Sue got her second visitor during our interview. Hi. Hi. Hi, you need some dishes for your kitchen. <laughs> the woman who paid to put Sue into an apartment and does not want to be identified stopped by. She donated dishes, towels, pillows, and an air mattress, along with a futon and other things. Thank you doesn't even, it doesn't even, doesn't have enough weight to it. You know, more words than that. I'm trying to wrap my mind around it all. You know, yeah. it happened so fast, too, that I, yeah, like I said, I'm holding back. I'm, I'm going to just cry. In Chandler, Vincent Bland in ABC 15, Arizona. Pretty powerful stuff right there. She says she's grateful for the countless viewers who emailed in, people reaching out out of the goodness of their heart to help. Yeah, and our Vinny Bland, uh, Blanton said that it's been the most fulfilling story to watch from start to finish and be able to see her reaction. Yeah, right there, I know so. she already wants to pay it forward, so we'll hopefully hear more from Sue very soon. She also wants to make soft tacos <laughs> in her new home. That's <laughs> that her plan. That's her plan.